But number 10, question 10 is interesting. How many times do we make series one? Um, if you're being literal about it, obviously we only made series one once, but we did have a unusual uh, time at the BBC when we were trying to make series one. And it resulted in us having to do something quite unusual. I don't want to try and give it away. Mm -hmm. um, but basically, I've given you time now. How many times did we make series one? We made series one twice because there was an electrician strike. And so we basically rehearsed every single show and we're just about to go into the studio and then it would be canceled because the electrician strike. And we rehearsed the entire series. So we had the entire series under our belt, although we never shot any of it. Because with a sitcom, what you do is you rehearse in the week and nail the whole thing down so that you can basically perform it very, you know, like a live performance, like a theatrical performance in front of an audience. And in order to do that, you have to rehearse it and know it inside out and have it completely planned as much as you can. Um, and actually the answer isn't quite twice because towards the end of series one, we reshot some episodes or some scenes from episode one, the end again. So in theory, we actually made series one two point what's one two two point and a half of a sixth whatever that is <laughs> a twelfth is that be twelfth right oh, okay so it'll be two two and a twelfth two and a twelfth uh, we, we actually uh, that's how many times you made series one um, and then of course with series one was remastered so I guess you could say that's uh, we redid it again but only in part um, and that was an interesting experience putting some colour back into it because the show we used to shoot on tape of course now everything's digital and you can shoot straight onto um onto card um and uh, but it used to be on tape and so when when we were editing we every time you had to re-edit you had to lay the whole show down onto a fresh tape so uh, if you went wanted to have to go back and change something then it meant going down a generation as we call it Mm -hmm. And we could really only do four generations of tape before the pictures just became too manky and wouldn't be transmittable. Mm -hmm. And then when we got to the remastering and we could digitally remaster the, the shows, we went back to the original takes, the original tapes from the studios, not the edit tape. So you'd have the original studio tape, you'd edit onto another tape, you'd edit onto another tape, you'd edit onto another tape. Mm -hmm. By this time, generations quality were going down. Mm -hmm. And then we would... So we, we went back to the original tapes that were recorded in the studios. We digitally um, laid them down and remastered them. And the remastered, it's quite interesting if you can be bothered to, to buy the remastered versions of Red Dwarf and compare it to the originals, you'll see a massive difference. And we also reconstructed some model shots and, and used some early CG effects. So there you go. Uh, well, uh, so the, answer could, could, the answer could be one, two, two and a twelfth, or three and a twelfth. Well, uh, no, not three. Three and a twelfth and a half. I think. <laughs> <laughs>